Hi, my name is Hassan Amir, and as part of the Dead Poets series, I'll be reading a poem from one of my favorite poets, Nazar Qabbani. Nazar was a Syrian poet, and growing up, my dad used to buy a lot of his books, so I used to read them. And one poem really struck out with me. I'll be reading that poem for you today. So I'll be reading it in the English translated version of the Arabic original poem. It's called A Lesson in Drawing. My son places his paint box in front of me and asks me to draw a bird for him. Into the color gray, I dip the brush and draw a square with locks and bars. Astonishment fills his eyes. But this is a prison, father. Don't you know how to draw a bird? And I tell him, son, forgive me. I've forgotten the shapes of birds. My son puts a drawing box in front of me and asks me to draw a wheat stalk. I hold the pen and draw a gun. My son mocks my ignorance, demanding, Don't you know, father, the difference between a wheat stalk and a gun? I tell him, son, once I used to know the shapes of wheat stalks, the shape of the loaf, the shape of the rose. But in this hardened time, the trees of the forest have joined the militiamen, and the rose wears dull fatigues in this time of armed wheat stalks, armed birds, armed culture, and armed religion. You can't buy a loaf without finding a gun inside. You can't pluck a rose in the field without its raising its thorns in your face. And you can't buy a book that doesn't explode between your fingers. My son sits at the edge of my bed and asks me to recite a poem. A tear falls from my eyes onto the pillow. My son licks it up, astonished, saying, But this is a tear, father, not a poem. And I tell him, When you grow up, my son, and read the Diwan of Arabic poetry, you'll discover that the word and the tear are twins, and the Arabic poem is no more than a tear wept by writing fingers. My son lays down his pens, his crayon box, in front of me, and asks me to draw a homeland for him. The brush trembles in my hands, and I sink, weeping. Thank you so much.